Hi, good morning. Um, this is Lisa Marie. I am getting ready to go to the gym. This is a day in my life. I am tired. It's 4.37 a.m. I'm getting ready to go to the gym. I am... Um, about four hours sleep and I am um, um, yeah the only word I can say is tired if I'm honest with B formation you can't think about it too long you have to just get up so now my body clock I naturally just get up at about 4 4 30 and I um just get ready so I'm gonna go and take all my supplements and my vitamins and get to the gym see you soon hi good morning I'm just doing my um, vitamins and supplements now <sighs> as I said um, Everything I do with this program, I try not to think about it too much. I've got a list in my kitchen on the cupboard of what I'm eating. And I'm now literally writing down when I'm eating because you can get so busy at work that you don't actually um, stop to have a lunch break. That's how things are for some people in the pandemic. Especially if you're working from home, you're sometimes working harder. So I am going to have this um, breakfast drink. we have every morning and then my tablets I don't look forward to this this is like when you're a kid and you have to have um, castor oil I can't remember what oil it was but when I was a kid my dad used to make me drink um, this oil every morning and he wouldn't buy the orange flavor he said it's not supposed to be nice so we just had to drink it I'm organised, so I've got a little dosset box with my vitamins in. I'm kind of used to this now. Some people say things that you're um, things that are good for you don't always taste nice. I try not to think about the taste. I try to just do what I've got to do. I'm having this before I train. <sighs> yeah, I'm, yeah. The only thing I can think of is the word tired. I'm trying to make this an enjoyable day in the life, but this is a day in my life. You will be tired and you cannot find excuses. got things to do, we just have to get them done. Right, so got my water. My hair is messy. I'm not one of those women that goes to the gym looking pretty. I'm not interested. I just gotta get there. So. Hi, good morning. Just getting into my car to go to the gym starting to feel a bit more awake now um, I will put in my airpods because when I get there I'm going to zone out 
and um, yeah, just do what I got to do. And um, it's raining, rainy day in London, and I want to go to my bed. So I'm at the gym. My favourite machine, I don't even know what you call it, is this um, machine. <laughs> I did do my workout, so I'm just doing different stages. But I'm here. That's the beautiful thing about training. Once you actually get to the gym, everything takes care of itself. But getting out of bed is the battle. So, I will catch up with you. Hi, I'm just shouting ya to say the best thing about going to the gym is leaving it. Just finished my session. I was there for an hour and a half. None of this stuff is easy, and you definitely have to commit the time as well as the um, commitment. So I feel good. Was tired this morning, but once the um, training is over, you feel good about yourself and you're ready to start your day. When I get home, I will have my breakfast. So, where have I parked? Okay, day in the life. Hi, good evening. Um, long day at work. Had my lunch. Had my um, additional meal, kind of mid-afternoon meal. Got through the day. Left work at a decent hour. Feeling um, quite energised. I think it's all the various things that B tells us to have as supplements throughout the day although I had a really early start at the gym early this morning I feel like I have been able to get through the day with relative calm um, definitely feeling aches and pains in various parts of my body but also feeling more energetic and just better for the early morning training so um, how am I feeling I'm feeling like I'm doing something that's very hard and challenging and something that I should have done a long time ago so getting on with it and um, to me every day is a day on the program so I'm back at it in the morning so I'm gonna try and get an early night tonight just gonna go in sort out my dinner and relax. Right, getting ready for bed now um, been a very very long day I absolutely feel exhausted but also quite um, ready for tomorrow. In B formation, I just feel like you just count the days until the week's over. You literally count every single day of the eight weeks and you just do a countdown. Can't say the word fun comes into my vocabulary, if I'm honest. There's nothing fun about this process. It's just something that has to be done and Every day that I complete, I just tick off. Um, the other people on it, everyone's on their journey. People are very supportive, but focused. So it's not a holiday camp at all. In fact, it's the opposite. It's like a job. And it's one of the most important jobs you'll do because it's about your health and your fitness and your future. And what I like is that I will develop habits that I can take with me especially with food and exercise. The myth of you can't train every day, that you need rest days, just train different body parts and um, use different apparatus and train for different periods of time. The morning works for me because I know that the morning is uninterrupted, not work or family or anyone will bother me this early because I'm awake when people are sleeping. So, I'm gonna go to bed, try 
trying this 9 p.m. thing that ain't really working out <sighs> because life happens. But I hope you got a little insight into a day in my life. Um, I've had my dinner and I'm gonna go to bed. So in a few hours, I will do it all again. <laughs>